genius is at work here. I cannot afford any distractions. If you require salvage, you can... Oh, a hunter. <laughs> yes, good, good. I was hoping one would stop by. There's no time to waste. Uh... Aloy. That old boar, Karaf, is expecting me to merely make the best armor in the Forbidden West. But I, Honda, will give him a masterpiece. And you are going to help me make it. Of course, you'll be compensated. Though seeing me at work should be gratifying enough. You're one of Karaf's people? So you're competing to make armor for him, too. With the Tanakh right next door? Ha! <laughs> They've got problems of their own to worry about. Besides, I'm not just making armor. I'm making a work of art imbued with the majesty of ancient machines and wondrous relics. With the steadfastness of the gentle plow horn and the fury of the raging ravager. So, where do you want to start? So you want your armor to wield a Ravager's Fury. Sounds interesting. I tracked down a pack of them near here. Shoot off one of their cannons, and I can make my armor just as deadly. I'll, uh, take a look. See what I can do. Well, if you get to it, we'll pick it up when you're done. You said you wanted ancient machine parts for your armor? Yes, there's entire graveyards of them nearby. Dreadful things. With some of their parts, I can make armor that will instill fear and disquiet in the enemy. I'll, uh, read up on the details. Splendid! I look forward to your success. You talked about using ancient relics for your armor? Correct. But that dream has fizzled like a wet forge. What do you mean? I acquired scouting reports on this area dating back to the Red Raids. They told of ruins filled with treasure. But some of our younger recruits stole the scrolls and absconded to go after the relics. I want them found before they run away with my salvage. I can try to track them down. Give them a good thrashing for me while you're at it, will you? You talked about using plowhorn parts for your armor? I've been eyeing a herd not too far from here. If you can bring me the right parts, this armor will be as unwavering as they are. I can try. Oh. One more thing. Uh, Plowhorns sometimes leave a trail of flowers in their path. The Utaru infuse some kind of drink with them to soothe the mind. I'd like to try it, to see if it inspires any ideas. Right. I'll see what I can do. I have to go. Luck be with you.
The Ravager's Honda mentioned should be nearby. I just need to look at that contract one more time. Make sure I got all the details right. This must be the drop-off point Honda's contract mentioned. When I get that Ravager cannon, I'll know where to take it. There they are. Honda wants one of those cannons. I'll need to shoot it off without killing the Ravager. Otherwise, I might damage the goods. Could hit it with acid. I should get that cannon before I take off. It looks like it's got a canister on its back. I'm sure Honda won't mind me borrowing this for a bit. A card I saw before. That's where I need to drop off this cannon. Do it. I should let Honda know her crew can pick this up.
Ah, been taking care of those contracts for me? I dropped off that Ravager cannon for you. Splendid! That kind of power will improve my armor. I know it. Consider the contract fulfilled. Does this mean you can start working on your armor now? Not quite. I was taking a morning walk to clear my mind for the visionary task ahead of me. And I ran across a herd of lance horns. Swift, delicate, but vigorous. The best armor in the Forbidden West should be just as nimble. And I'll need their parts to achieve that. I might be able to hunt them down for you. That's all I needed to hear. I have to go. The best of luck to you. No one's batting an eye at Anora being all the way out here. That's all I'm saying. 